What's up affiliate marketing family? We have a great video. We have two amazing affiliate networks right here. I'm gonna put them toe to toe and go over which affiliate network is better. And I'm gonna assess them on a number of criteria. Now, between these two companies, about a billion dollars worth of commissions is paid out every single year to affiliate marketers. And these are two of the behemoths in the industry and I'm gonna assess them both on a number of different factors including what countries you can join them from, how often they ha do payouts, how they pay you out, how many products each of the networks have, how long the cookie duration is and what cookie duration is and also if they pay you, if you refer your friends to them. So let's assess all of these factors of both of these affiliate networks. Let's get into it. My name is John Cristani. I've been doing affiliate marketing for about 10 years now, and I've made over $10 million with affiliate marketing, and I'm gonna show you what is up, who is the better affiliate network. Let's get into it. Mmm, that, that is good. I love my money, and I get my money from affiliate networks. I'm John Cristani, been doing affiliate marketing for a little bit now, 10 years. And my best year doing affiliate marketing, I did almost $4 million in a single year with affiliate marketing. And I'm gonna show you two of the biggest and best affiliate networks between these two companies, they do about $1 billion in sales in 2019. So you'll wanna listen up. They've paid out almost a billion dollars in sales a year, both of these. If that's mind boggling, just type in mind blown down in the comments below because this is pretty exciting. So first off, I'm gonna assess these on a number of different factors. We're gonna start with the payouts, okay? So I'm gonna flip flop around. But payouts meaning, what's their payout frequency meaning? How often can you expect to get paid from Digistore or ClickBank? Now, the payouts, both of them are weekly, okay? So we see Digistore pays out weekly and so does ClickBank. Before I go too deep into ClickBank and uh, Digistore, something to understand about both of these affiliate networks is both of them focus on digital products, okay? And digital products are probably the best thing to sell on the internet because using digital marketing, you sell digital products. Highest commissions, most competitive environment for affiliates, that's what you wanna be selling if you're gonna be marketing products on the internet, especially as an affiliate, which is a very competitive industry. Now, Digistore is based in Germany, okay? And they started a number of years ago, whereas ClickBank is based in the US and they started 20 years ago. So ClickBank's been around for a very long time. And they do, I estimate, about half a billion or six, something around there, half a billion dollars worth of commissions paid out every single year. Whereas Digistore pays out about $300 million every single year. Now, most of the products sold through the ClickBank platform are sold in the US. And I'll get into those reasons a little later. Most of the products sold in Digistore are sold in Europe, and I'll get into why that is in a little bit. But Digistore recently expanded to the US and they started their own US division, which makes a comparison worthwhile for everyone to understand what are the nuances in working with either of these platforms. Now, what's interesting to note is what countries can you be an affiliate from? You know, as an affiliate marketer, you get paid for posting links about other companies' products. And if somebody buys those products, then you get a commission. Now, in terms of what countries these two affiliate networks accept affiliates from to get paid, they Digistore accepts people from all countries around the world. I think there are a few exceptions, such as North Korea, right? Whereas ClickBank mainly accepts affiliates from the Americas, North and South American continents, as well as Europe. So ClickBank is a little bit more limited in terms of the number of countries they accept, whereas Digistore accepts any affiliate from anywhere. As long as you can sell people's products, they will pay you money. The next factor that's interesting to note is age. So both of these affiliate networks have no discrimination when it comes to age. So you can be any age you want 
and start making money. You could be five years old and make money with either Digistore or ClickBank. They don't discriminate based on age. As long as you are producing sales for the companies that you are posting links about, then you make money. Now, the ways you can get paid from Digistore include PayPal, ACH, and Wire, whereas ClickBank will pay out through ACH, Check, and Wire. Meaning with ClickBank, you need a address to ship a check to, which is ACH, or you need a bank account to send a wire to. Whereas with Digistore, you can get paid through both of those methods, but you can also get paid through PayPal, which is a bit easier and more convenient for some people. So Digistore wins in the payout methods. Why after 20 years is ClickBank not allowed payouts through PayPal? I don't know, but getting paid out through PayPal is something I think a lot of people like especially when doing affiliate marketing. Now the next factor is the variety of products that you can promote. How many companies list their products on ClickBank versus Digistore? Now personally, my, I have a product and it's listed on both platforms. So I have a training product called the Super Affiliate System. It's a thousand dollar course teaching marketing and it is listed on both Digistore and ClickBank. But ClickBank clearly wins this one because ClickBank has 3,000 different companies, over 3,000 companies that have products listed on their marketplace. 3,000 products that you can promote as an affiliate, whereas Digistore only has about 100 products that you can promote as an affiliate. So a lot less variety there, a lot less to choose from just less selection overall and as an affiliate marketer you want a big selection of products to choose from because you just want to test products against each other. Okay so what the heck is cookie duration? So cookie duration is how long after somebody clicks on your link will you get credit for the purchase? Because a lot of people they don't purchase something the same day they visit the site. Sometimes people think about it, right? A cookie duration is basically when somebody clicks, it leaves a little file and it says, this affiliate sent the click. And as an affiliate, after the purchase is made, that cookie says, hey, give this affiliate their commission. That's how affiliate tracking works. It's kind of like a technical term. A cookie is an actual file. It's like a cookie crumb is what it's a reference to. It's a little file in, the back of your computer somewhere that identifies you. Now, ClickBank, 60 days after a cookie is placed, after somebody clicks on your link, if they buy the product, you get paid. Okay, 60 days. Even if that person thinks about it for two months, you'll get paid. What's great about that is many products you enter your email address or you know let's say you go to a store and you enter your email address and you subscribe to their discounts and maybe a month or so goes by and then you get an email that has a particularly good offer in it and you say okay I'm gonna buy this product now or I'm ready. So you'll still get credit for that sale. Whereas Digistore they give it a 180 day cookie. Frankly that's a little excessive right? Most people, if they didn't buy within the first 60 days, they're not gonna buy the product after that. But that being said, this is good for the affiliate marketer because it means the affiliate marketer gets credit for the clicks and the traffic they are sending to the company for long after, half a year after they actually originally brought awareness and sent that click. So this is good for the affiliate and Digistore wins this one. Now the last factor I'm looking at is referrals. If you refer a friend to use their affiliate network, if you refer a friend to be an affiliate marketer under either the Digistore or the ClickBank platform, do you get paid for referring them to that platform? Well, ClickBank you don't get paid. You used to, they used to have a feature where if I said, hey, come do affiliate marketing on the ClickBank platform, I would get paid as the kind of shepherd or the influencer, whatever you wanna call it. This was years ago that they offered that, but they don't currently. Whereas on Digistore, you do get paid if you refer other people to do affiliate marketing and, and sell stuff through their platform. Now, the way it works is you only make a very small commission percentage if you refer people to be affiliate marketers through the platform. You only make 
it's like a quarter of a percent or something like that. But it still is something that is meaningful, especially if you are sending a lot of people or if you're sending very successful people to the affiliate platform. So that's something that is very much in just the favor of affiliate marketing in general. It seems to make sense. You're bringing awareness to a company, you get credit for helping them out. So overall, that's my assessment of Digistore versus ClickBank. Now, obviously, you see a lot more blue on this side of the category. So Digistore seems to win this, but ClickBank has a huge trump card and it's that 3,000 different companies are on ClickBank. So you just have a lot more variety of vendors. Now that being said, Digistore is very new to the United States market, the English speaking market. So they're just getting started and we'll see how fast this grows. But ClickBank has a huge variety and it's just the behemoth in the industry. Either way, no matter which network you wanna join, there are links below to get started with both Digistore and ClickBank where you can sign up for them. Now another great plus about Digistore is obviously they accept people from all countries. So many people simply will not be able to be a part of ClickBank even if they wanted to. So ClickBank isn't even an option for many people out there. Also, if you don't have a place to send a check to or a bank wire to and you wanna get paid through PayPal, then Digistore is the only option. And these two features are pretty strong. Some people can't work with ClickBank if they don't, if they can only be paid through PayPal or if they're located in other third world countries. So these two factors combined, combined with the fact that the leadership over at Digistore is very aggressive. They're young German guys who are in their late 30s or early 40s, something like that. Very aggressive business owners. I believe Digistore is going to grow and take a lot of market share from ClickBank as time goes forward because simply affiliate marketing is an international business, first and foremost. Anybody with an internet connection can do it and should be able to do affiliate marketing. And the fact that Digistore is supporting international affiliate marketing, I think is a really big plus. And I, I think you'll see a lot more vendors coming on Digistore as well as affiliates in the coming years really because this is a long-term game and I'd love to see that because I love supporting affiliates no matter where they're from. If you're from Morocco, if you're from Nigeria, if you're from India or Bangladesh, I think everybody should be able to do affiliate marketing. If you're creating sales for a company, you should get paid. And if you agree with me, let me know. And let me know in the comments, what is your favorite affiliate network? Is it Digistore or ClickBank? And what's the biggest factor for you? Is it the pay methods of payout? Is it the products? Is it the cookie duration? What is the biggest factor for you? I'll go deeper. If I get enough people that are interested in me talking about Digistore, I'll start going deeper into Digistore. Obviously, I've listed my product on there. We have a bunch of affiliates promoting it. We're the number one product on Digistore right now, although we do a lot more volume on ClickBank. So I'd love to hear your thoughts. Type in the comments below. Make sure you like this video, subscribe, hit the notification bell, quit your job, drop out of school, and take back control of your life as always. I'll see you tomorrow.